Hello and Merry Christmas from me, Andy, and the whole team here at To Ho Holman. Welcome to a very festive edition of In The Shop. Christmas is a time of giving, a time of goodwill. Sometimes, however, as musicians, we don't always receive gifts that are entirely useful or indeed are any good and a little bit naff. Thankfully, I'm here to give you a guide of the five worst gifts that musicians receive. The elves here at home have selected me five things that we offer that you do not want to receive as a gift as a musician. So uh, let's start at number five. Let me set the scene. It's Christmas. It's hot. You're sat in front of the Yule log fire drinking eggnog. It's a little bit too warm. What you need is a fan to cool you down and keep you cool. But you might need to sing a song at the same time so it's got some musical notes on it. No thoughts gone into that whatsoever. Thanks, elves. It wouldn't be Christmas without socks. Probably the worst present for a guitar player, it is the Harley Benton pick cutter. And with this, if you run out of picks, you can cut some picks yourself using your credit cards, which you obviously have hanging around. It does come with some pick material and you slide it in there and you cut a pick. So now you have this terrible piece of plastic. Then you spend your time sanding off the edges or you just spend 50 cents and buy yourself a pick. A mouse pad with a treble clef on it. In at number one of the top five worst presents for musicians is a whole subgenre of gifts that holds a special place of hatred in my heart. It is anything that combines music and cookery. For example, let me show you. This guitar-shaped cutting board. Why? A guitar-shaped spoon. A guitar-shaped spatula that flips burgers and cuts things. Also opens your beer. No. This next one is, is kind of borderline cool. It's a DJ vinyl pizza cutter, so you can splice out some tasty beats. I'm not sure if that belongs on the list. Number one of the number ones is this, a musical instrument themed tea towel for when you want to be playing your instrument but you have to do the washing up. Terrible. That's our list of top five worst gifts for musicians, but don't worry, coming up now is top five really good gifts. Here we go. Up first on our top five list of good ideas for presents for musicians is for drummers. It is a pendant that is also a drum key so you can tune your drums and look good at the same time. Nice one. Up next is a guitar amp. No, it's a key holder. This is a key ring that you put your keys on, you screw that to the wall and then you hold your keys in there. That is a funky present. I'd like that as a present. And at number three is a gift that every musician needs. It's a metronome. I can't think of one musician that wouldn't want to keep better time. Metronome. Rock and roll and drinking often go hand in hand, especially at Christmas. Picture the scene. You're at rehearsal practicing for your big Christmas gig and you need some cool liquid refreshment. What you need is a drink from your Marshall Amp fridge. Ah, tasty. The ultimate Christmas gift for musicians is of course gear or a Tolman gift card so they can buy the gear themselves. The rest of the presents is a nice little trinket, but all we really want is the instruments and music and things. Thanks so much for watching our rundown of best and worst Christmas gifts. Before we go, it was the night before Christmas and all through the house, not a creature was stirring. Except a competition to win 100 euros here at Toman. Leave us a comment down below. Tell us the worst musically themed Christmas gift you've ever received and what you would have preferred to receive instead. So worst present, what you really wanted for Christmas. I'll choose the best comment and that person will walk away with 100 euros to spend here at Tolman. 
I want to wish you a very Merry Christmas from me, Andy, behind the camera, Yuri. Say your Merry Christmas, Yuri. Merry Christmas. And everybody here at Toho Homer. Merry Christmas. Bye-bye.